right guys, I've been getting a lot of questions. People are really excited to be breaking in their new sleds. And so I've been getting the question, what do I do to break in a new snowmobile? So luckily for us in Colorado here, we've been getting blessed with some early season snow. So uh, being able to get up on the trail and do some heat cycles on the sled, that's, that's really key. So what I mean by a heat cycle is basically um, what I do is at the shop, before I even get up on the mountain, I'll start the sled um, with my uh, one quart of oil and a full tank of gas uh, mixed in the sled. I'll start the sled, let it get up to operating temperature, which is about that 120 degrees on your, on your coolant temp, and then open up the side panels, let the sled cool all the way back down. I'll do that two times. I'll just do that at the shop. And then once I get up on the mountain here, again, um, not getting too excited in the parking lot, being, not being a parking lot racer, uh, start up the sled, let the sled get up to temperature, and then uh, try to get one more heat cycle before you go ride it. And uh, what I'm gonna do today is gonna, I'm gonna slap a GoPro on, and I'm gonna show you how I like to run the throttle when braking in the snowmobile. The most important thing is not keeping the throttle in one position and not doing sustained long wide open pulls. So varying the throttle, mixing in short full throttle bursts and uh, just letting the sled cool down.